A Tennessee judge has sided with 20 states, including ours, saying new federal protections for the LGBTQ community infringed on states' rights. News Channel 5's Cole Johnson covering this for us live from downtown Nashville. So, Cole, what does this ruling do? Good morning to you both. Well, the judge put a temporary pause on a couple of federal agencies from enforcing these directives until another court decision. So there's just that pause that we're dealing with right now, but we want to go focus in on what we're really dealing with here. So there are those two different agencies. That's the Department of Education and the Equal Employment Opportunity Commission. These directives are dealing with LGBTQ discrimination. The Department of Education guidance said discrimination based on a student's sexual orientation or gender identity violates Title IX. The EEOC's directive was to lay out what would qualify as discrimination for this community and explained how to file a complaint. The AP reports the Biden administration was in part taking a stand against laws growing that wouldn't let transgender girls play on female sports teams. The attorney general said attorneys general say these kinds of decisions fall under Congress, the states and the people. And we know that these court cases, they can be very complicated, but we're going to have a more in-depth look on this up on newschannel5.com a little later on this morning.